Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming in with another episode of Fallout 4. All right, and we left off. We had, uh, well, came back to the sanctuary and uh, did a couple things, did a couple modded weapons and whatnot, and, you know, goofed off with that a little bit. And uh, I've distributed them, most of them, as best as I possibly can. And, uh, yeah, that's about it. They haven't done much else other than that, so we're pretty much ready to go. But uh, the thing is, I don't quite know where we should be going. <laughs> we just did the uh, molecular levels uh, prior quest, and now we have to get the Corsair chip analyzed, and that's the problem. Um, <laughs> I kind of don't want to do that. But I do have a level up in the backlog, so I might as well get that done. Um, put this somewhere, but where is the question. Um, science rank 3 would be nice, but... Uh, honestly, I think we need to go further down the uh, stat trees, if anything. Huh. Give me a moment. Yeah, I had to uh, look into something, but I think uh, I'm going to put this into agility to eventually get Action Boy to raise my action points for generation rate. And uh, then we're just going to keep going down until we hit about here. Then we're just going to level all of them off at six before I start considering anything else. That's what I think I'm going to do anyway. So, with that in mind... Let's, uh, let's do what I wasn't necessarily thinking I should be doing and uh, do the molecular level. So we'll have to go back to Grey Garden for this. This will uh, be a thing. Not Grey Garden, good neighbor. I was screwing up my G names. Oops. It's a good neighbor. That's what I had to think about. Okay. Honestly, the laser rifle's design is kind of cool, but at the same time, eh, <laughs> you know? It's like, you prefer the feel of the real guns, you know? Maybe that's just me, I don't know. Wow, this place is a short hole. And here I thought it couldn't get any worse than the combat zone. Kate, come on, be nice. They try. They try their best. Hey, hey Cleo. Every weapon you see here could be the difference between life and death, baby. It, it, I, I love the fact that <laughs> sure. coming in here in power armor yeah, makes it impossible to look Cleo in the quote-unquote eyes <laughs> or eye at all. <laughs> Just power armor makes it almost impossible because of that little overhanging thing right there. I figured at some point they were just going to get rid of that in like a patch or something. Never happened. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'll take it. Sure. But at the same time, it's it's goofy. It's a little goofy. Anyway, um, I was coming in here to get a fusion core and I passed right by him because I'm an idiot. Uh, there we go. Uh, at this point of the game, you just buy up fusion cores as much as you can while you're running the uh, power armor. Because at some point you're going to need them, and you're going to need a lot of them. So you might as well do it when you have the chance. And uh, that's kind of what I'm going to be doing for right now. Um, it now strikes me I don't have a lot of things to, <laughs> a lot of things to sell to get that. Yeesh. Yeesh. <laughs> I didn't think that through. Uh, um, <laughs> I probably should have, though. Um, I have to sell off some of the ammo that I'm not using in relatively high qualities. Quantities. That, too. That's a word as well that I could have used. High qualities or quantities. There we go. Do I need that many missiles? No, I can get rid of nine of them. There we go. I definitely do not need those harpoons. 
The shotguns are for particular enemies, so I might as well keep those around. Um, 10 mil. Now there's the question. Um, eventually at this point of the game, it's better to phase out the weapons that don't do a lot of damage. And unfortunately, even though it is far stronger than the conventional 10 millimeter pistol, the P99 is still not that high up in damage. And it sucks because I would rather have a mod in the, you know, in the weapon itself that could adjust the damage with me so that way I can keep using it much like I do with the AUG and you can with the uh, RU-556 and most of the other weapons of that sort of type, but they don't have that option in there and that makes it difficult to justify bringing it with you into the uh, later part of the game so I, honestly I could go like I don't even need a suppressed P99 that much I could just go with the Colt version of the pistol put a suppressor on one have the other one normal and just do that if I really needed to and just devote all my time on 45 ammo because there is plenty of that <laughs> to be dumping my money into it's not like it's rarer than the 10 mil 45 is far more far more of a higher quality quality and quantity overall It'd be better off if I just did the 45s. But anyway. Yeah, I'm just going to sell some of these off now that I don't need as many of them as I thought I did. <laughs> Whoops. Uh, that's not what I meant to do. There we go. That works. And I guess I could do another fusion core. There we go. And for the rest, I'll just buy 45 <laughs> ammo because I was just talking about that and how useful it is so I guess it'd be better if I did that um, yeah there we go um, yeah I think that's about it I think that's all I really need to do yeah we'll do that that works thank you Cleo alrighty I'm not buying that we come in peace malarkey. You probably shouldn't, honestly. You probably shouldn't for multiple reasons. Okay, now the thing we needed to go to was back into the memory den with the chip. So in we go. And I grab my coffee. Because I'm still fairly sleepy. Alright, there we are. As you could tell by me constantly using the wrong words multiple times. Alright. Hi there, Amari. You're back. The glowing sea. Virgil. What happened? <laughs> yeah, you know. Um, you know, took a radiation bath, hung out with a big green guy, then I pulled this encoded chip out of a courser's neck. He was not happy. Of course not. Courser chip. You fought a Corso. Oh my god. Yeah. Fortunately, I can't help you. I it was quicker than I thought it was. But never a Corso. Going to be. I don't know what that chip does, let alone how to decode it. But there Fair are enough. people who might. I work with a group that, well, they're the only ones I know that even have a chance of cracking Institute security. They're called right. the Railroad. Yep. <laughs> Next up, the Railroad. Choo -choo. <laughs> uh, yes. Just the delivery on that line. It's priceless. <laughs> Follow the freedom trail. Good luck. Alrighty. <laughs> In my secret club, the code phrase is just two words. Awesome and me. Yes, well, that's not going to help you here. But I'm sure someone with your creativity will be able to figure it out. 
that was creative. Fuck you. <laughs> that was creative. Kate liked it. Kate liked my creativity. Fuck you. Uh, I am a child. All right, onward we go. <sighs> All right. Let us continue. And uh, we'll just run this until the ammo runs out for the time being. But uh, eventually we'll hit a point where it's not even worth keeping up with that. Which sucks because I love the P99. <laughs> But there, like I said, there comes a point where just 10 millimeter ammo does not carry you the rest of the game. 45 will, especially with some of the modded pistols for 45, which is annoying. <laughs> uh, whoa, the fuck was that? <laughs> what? You all saw that, right? That wasn't just on my end. I have no idea why that... Okay. Why wow, that static thing just happened. Um. <laughs> uh, why is it every game I play breaks? <laughs> every single game I play on this channel breaks so hard at a certain point. <sighs> That's the fully modded version of the Death Claw uh, gauntlet weapon. If I remember right, it, it doesn't even have, like, the top one, usually. It just has the two on the sides. Alright. Was that necessary? Also, radiation storm. Woo! That's great. That's what we needed. Alright. I have no idea where the, all that shooting's coming from. I'm willing to bet. It's probably Postal Square. Or something like that. Anywho... Well, we're supposed to find the railroad, and uh, it's not really pointing us in the direction to for finding the railroad, isn't it? Damn it! <laughs> Don't remember where to go for that. Oh, the Revere Satellite Array—that was a thing that I needed to do too, because that was shenanigans. Oh boy! All right, not fallen sky bridge. Where do, I, where do I go to do that again? Is it... It was Boston Common, right? I think it was Boston Common. Uh, which, at that point, it'd be easier just to walk there a little bit, wouldn't it? Just a little? At the same time, I need to know where I'm going. Oh, jeez. What the... Oh. Hi there. Uh, nothing. You don't need to know. You don't need to know anything, buddy. Okay, well. There we go. Well, hi there. Um, it's, it's me. Oh, jeez. Fucking hell. Of course, it had to be from the fucking... Oh, legendary, of course. Why wouldn't it be a legendary? Because that'd be just fan-fucking-tastic for you guys, wouldn't it? If it was a legendary. God uh, this this is what I mean. At, at some what? Two of them. I was just getting warmed up. Um. Um. That was the first I've seen of that. Okay. Well, I'll take this. If merely for the selling. Well, I mean, kind of. Oh, geez. Where are you shooting? Also, damn, you're shooting fast. Ghoul Slayer's metal left leg. I mean, that's not super useful, but I mean, something. Is it done? Well, you're saying that, and yet I've killed all your fellows, including two legendaries of your fellows. So, I mean, you can say that all you damn well please. I'm uh, thinking you're wrong. Fucking hell. <laughs> oh, jeez. I forgot I was in power armor for a split second, so I, was I thought I was falling to my death, and then I realized, oh, wait. You 
can't do that in power armor because physics are broken in power armor. Oh, are you now? Are you now? Well, it's a little harder to do when you can't see me and I can't see you now, don't it? Yep. Putz. All right, well. Can't. <laughs> Apparently can't see me so much that we stop being angry at each other, I guess. All right, well, I'll grab all this stuff anyway. Fragmentation. Ooh. Ooh, useful to break down. Useful to break down. Pulse mine. Useful to saddle. I can't. I can't see anyone. Also, I noticed there's a generator over there. All right, well. Ah. I thought that was going to be more of a slam than it was. Huh. And that was more of a slam. That made sense. Because broken. Alright. Let's reload. Good shit. Yeah, wait. I don't think there's anything else I can do here. Kaboom. Okay, <laughs> you are in power armor. The physics are broken. You're fine. I say the physics are broken because I just gotten done not that long ago watching a uh, video uh, going into depth over the physics of how the power armor could, you know, potentially let you survive falls like that, and it shouldn't. <laughs> there is no way in hell you should be surviving, you know, a good two-thirds of the falls you can survive with the power armor. In fact, I think the power armor would let you survive any fall, like, from, like, the skyscrapers, like, you could do that, no problem in the power armor, and you shouldn't be able to do that, like, the way that it lands like that, it's, <laughs> it's kind of broken, honestly, but, I mean, at the same time, it's nice, <laughs> It's nice that we don't have to worry about fall damage in power armor. Uh, it's like, it's nice, but at the same time, it breaks all physics laws whatsoever. <laughs> it's, at that point, it's just like, yeah, whatever, right? Whatever. You give me a thing. Did I never go into Swan's Pond? Did I never go into Swan's Pond? Uh, no, no. Backing up. I could swear I went into Swan's Pond at some point. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. a chain up here and everything. Uh, uh, shit. I could have sworn we did this already. Mikhail, oh jeez. We read his little note thing. Isn't there... Didn't we... I swear we did the thing, didn't we? <laughs> I kind of don't want to do this. Oh, no. Uh, I'm going to bring out the broken weapon. Because <laughs> if this fight is still a pain in the ass, I'm going to need it. Oh, uh, boy. Okay. Um, it's, uh, huh, alright then, oh, I'm gonna be popping rads for a little bit, yes, jeez, the frame rate slowdown on that, oh boy, that was not good, speaking of not good, um, None of this. None of this is good. Oh, jeez. It, 
is he just not going to is he just not at all really like nothing huh Well then, I'll just read these then. <laughs> My physiological evolution seems to have stabilized. The medical team tells me, rather, that my muscle mass has more than tripled since the experiment began and my neural efficiency has improved markedly. This, is, this particular strain of modified FEV has been a remarkable success. I appear to have received all of the anticipated benefits without the typical adverse effects. Right. My application to join the research team is awaiting the director's approval. Although further tests may be in order, I hope to assist with my own experiment in the coming days. Oh, yeah. That's right. As we learned with uh, Virgil, they were apparently doing something with the FEV. I assume the director is part of the Institute, I'm assuming, and I'm hoping, oh, fuck, oh, fuck, okay, okay, well, this is a thing, this is a thing now, this is now a thing that we're doing, okay, well, this actually went a lot better than I thought it was gonna go, and I honestly gotta say, Kate's weapon helped. Cage for being amazing. Swan boat fragments. What? Oh, heavy combat armor left arm. <laughs> Not that I'm using that now, but how about that? Also, swan boat fragments. What was that again? That's fiberglass and plastic. That's still a lot of fiberglass. Considering. Whew! And it auto-saved to boot to make sure I don't have to do that again. Oh, thank you. Oh, that's nice. That's nice of you. Also, fusion core. All right. That was to be expected. All right, well. Oh, that went better than originally hoped. Uh, but at the same time, I had hoped I wouldn't have to do that. So, there's that. Broken lamp. Swan's note. You are swan. Um... Yeah, <laughs> you are, but at the same time, not the way you seem to be thinking. <laughs> Dressing yourself up in swan parts from boats. <laughs> well, I mean, reach their own, I guess. Um, I shouldn't really be talking like I'm the expert on things. That's day one here. So I nipped a few six. Big deal. Smart asses may run this place, but they just can't just do whatever they want. I got rights. Trial worked out for me in the end. They agreed to probation. I stay inside for a month, write something every day, and they'll bring me all the food and water I want. They think this is punishment? Sure beats scrubbing floors all day. I guess Swan was an asshole at the Institute. I guess. All right. Should have known something was wrong when they came back for more tests. Every bone in my body aches. I'm on edge all the time. Jittery. Can barely write. But my mind's just racing. Damn it, what's going on? What did they do to me? Well, um, I think you found out at some point, didn't you? Uh, day 21. So that was after the 14 one we just read. Seizures continue. After the second one this morning, I was ordered back to the observation lab for further study. My prognosis is poor. I made the discovery myself. The viral strain I was infected with is fundamentally unstable. My mental capacity peaked two days ago and has begun rapidly deteriorating. The seizures are just the beginning. Will they reject me like all the others? Like all the others? They did this to more people? Does that mean a lot of the fucking... Super mutants that are running around now are part of the Institute's ins experiments? That they're also their fault? Oh, Jesus. 
That's like the last thing that fucking Commonwealth needed, and of course they get it. That would explain why... <laughs> you know, while the Capital Wasteland Super Mutants are more yellowish green, that these ones are absolutely more green. And... Slightly more intelligent? I mean, they use proper full sentences, so I mean... Guess you could consider that higher intelligence if you want, but still. That's. That's shitty. It's absolutely shitty. Alright, well, I'm gonna end the episode here for right now because, well, I don't have more time to spend on this. So. Uh, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. Bleh. Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. Click the like button if you like this particular video. Share in comments so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together and I will see y'all in the next episode. This has been the one and the only Stray Cat playing games and doing more shenanigans for the fucking Courser Chip and killing swan which i thought we did but apparently we didn't and that was scary because <laughs> i know how that fight is without overpowered weapons like we got for you